सो हे गाइस वेलकम बैक टू माय चैनल फॉर ट्यूटोरियल्स सो गाइस टुडे आई विल टीच यू हाउ टू क्रिएट न्यू स्टाइल ऑफ एब्स्ट्रैक्ट शेप डिजाइन विद यूजिंग ब्लेंडर एंड साइकिल वेंडर so firstly guys click on here and delete all assets so now guys i'm going to take a torus this one and increase torus guys radius i like 0. Point, this one minus 0.6 and measure radius like 2 yeah that's my simple torus and next one guys i use sphere uv sphere yeah and now guys I apply subdivision surface on both objects. So go to on property modifier and use subdivision surface. Yeah, and guys, go to on render, render like six, and viewport level like three is good. And right click, shade smooth. Guys, I take one more. Yeah, okay. So guys, select this one, spare and same subdivision surface, and apply. Renders like six and viewport level four is good. And right click shade smoother. Yes. And next one, guys. I create rotation animation. So go to on here object properties and guys select this torus and rotation check all rotation check. And last one, guys rotation I like three sixty and three sixty three sixty. Yeah. And rotation check. so guys go to back and play yes that's my simple rotation animation right and guys same on here on sphere select this one guys go to on lines yes guys select this one sphere and rotation check guys go to on last one all rotation 360 and last one yes and click on animation key so go to back and play Yeah, see guys, that's my rotation animation. And now, guys, I apply twist effect on torus. So stop and go to back. So, guys, select this torus and use simple deformer. This one, yes. And see guys, that's my angle. So guys, angle like one three five. Yeah, and press. Animation key and last one two fifty frame, like minus three fifty, and press animation key. Yeah, so go to back and play. Yes, see guys, that's looking really good. That's my abstract art shape. Guys, rotation is really good. So stop now, guys. I apply SDR image. So go to on here world properties. And use environment texture, and guys apply any SDR. I like this one. So open, yeah. Okay. So next one, guys. I use plane and increase plane size like this. So press one and little bit down. Yeah, guys. That's my composition. And guys, little bit increase more. Okay, so guys, go to edit mode and select and press E and G. Guys, increase this extrude like this. Yeah, guys, select mid one and this time I apply bevel. So guys, bevel angle zero point two and segments are like forty, forty. Yes. So object mode and right click shade smoother. Yes. So now next one, guys, I use camera. And camera, and guys, check your camera angle. So press N. This one, go to on here view and camera to view check. Guys, set your camera angle. So camera focal length, I like thirty five. Yes. So guys, create animation. So first frame, go to on zero frame, and camera angle. Guys, set your camera angle like this. Press zero. And camera angle, it's good, yeah. And guys, press I, 
एंड यूज लोकेशन रोटेशन स्किल्स आई चेक या एंड गो टू लास्ट वन क्रिएट शेप लाइक दिस या एंड अगेन प्रेस आई एंड रोटेशन चेक या सो गो टू बैक एंड प्ले या सी गाइज दैट्स माई ब्यूटिफुल एनिमेशन एंड कैमरा एंड मूवमेंट एनिमेशन यस रियली गुड राइट ओके सो गाइज ऑल इज गुड नाउ गाइज आई अप्लाय एक्चुअली नाउ गो टू ऑन हेयर रेंडर सेटिंग सो गाइज यू साइकिल रेंडर एंड गाइज डिफाइज जी पी यू चेक जी पी यू एंड फीचर सेट यूज एक्सपेरिमेंटल दिस वन या एंड क्लिक ऑन हेयर दैट्स माई रैंडम viewport guys max sample like 64 and this one render like 128 is good for me yes okay so guys that's it all setting is good now guys go to on here that's my plain background plane and apply simple black color so base color i use black and metallic like 0.5 is good and roughness increase like 0.8 Yes, right. Okay, so guys, next one, camera view port uncheck and go to back and play. Yeah, that's really good. Okay, so guys, next one, I apply beautiful shader effector on this one objects. So stop. So guys, select this one shading mode. Go to on shading mode, and create new material. So create new. Yeah. Guys, see that's my principal BSDF. So guys, select this one and press Control T. Yeah, this one. Guys, if your shortcut command is not working, so go to on Edit Mode, Preferences, and type on here Add On Node. This one and select Node Wrangler. This one. So guys, close. So image texture, guys, delete. Press Delete key. Yeah, and go to Add. and use wave texture this one wave texture and next one i apply color ramp yes and guys little bit increase spacing yeah okay so guys go to on texture coordinate generate it correct to this one and guys go to on here mapping vector to vector check wave texture and color to check color ramp and this one color ramp color to use base color yeah see guys that's my wave texture wave effect and now guys i change rotation effect so go to on here mapping and rotation i like 90 yes much better right see guys that's my effect beautiful shape okay so next one guys go to our detail i like one yeah and guys I change color, so guys, I have color codes. See, guys, that's my UI gradient. So copy this color gradient. So copy and paste. Enter. Yeah, and click on made one. And one more time, guys. I change position like this. Select made one and select this one. and apply yeah and guys third one select and that's my orange color and apply yeah and guys this one made one i change to red and pink yeah good and last one white is good see guys last one is white and next one guys go to on metallic metallic 0.5 and roughness 0.3 yeah that's my looking some metallic effect right okay so guys now i go to render setting and go to on setting that's my material and displacement use displacement and bump but guys see that's not working so again go to add and use displacement map this one so guys go to on here That's my displacement. Connect with displacement material output, and next one, guys. That's my color ramp. So connect with height. Yeah. So closer. Yeah. See, guys. That's my beautiful displacement effect. Right. 
and guys mid level i like 0.2 and scale 0.2 yeah so go to on here that's my final render viewport yes see guys that's my beautiful shader see it's really beautiful right so guys same material apply on spare so go to on up guys select your material nodes and control press c copy go to on spare this one spare and create new material and delete your this one and apply press control v yeah see see guys that's my material and now guys you can also change this one wave texture so use ring yes and scale size little bit change like seven yes yeah all is good and guys all is good yeah okay so guys you can also change this one rotation is dependent your work so render uncheck yeah guys you can change this one yeah much better right see guys that's my beautiful wave texture material okay so next one guys select this spare and same go to material properties and go to on setting surface and displacement use displacement and bump yeah so go to on here again final renders viewport yeah see guys that's my beautiful shader guys it's not correct that's my some low poly effect so here viewport level you can increase like five and six yes much better right okay but five is good so next one guys go to on layout that's my final effect yeah that's my final so press zero and press n yeah okay so guys that's my final effect and i show you only one frame render so render image check yeah see guys that's my beautiful shader that's my beautiful displacement effect and next one guys i apply simple area light so stop this rendering press delete key escape key and here and use light and use area light and i select your light go to an up and light size i like three and power like 200 is good enter and duplicate this light and rotate guys rotate like this that's my 90 degree and go to our mid closer yeah so go to on again camera and camera check yeah see guys that's my final effect right okay so guys now i create jpeg sequences render so guys go to on here frame rate use 30 fps and output guys go to on desktop create new folder yeah that's my new folder and guys take any file name like a accept and go to on render and render animation check yeah okay so guys my final effect is finished that's my beautiful final effect so guys if you like my video please share and subscribe to this channel thank you